Hi, welcome back to the channel FC24. Alright, uh, how I wish I have a go key card, but unfortunately, you know, the CB. Uh, nonetheless, uh, another 1 million to pocket, uh, which is 30 million bucks pretty soon. Uh, the CB is good, but I think I already have um, 3 so far, so not gonna change and not require another. So, um, the other ones uh, will be any other positions, uh, probably work on that later on. For now, I'm gonna test it out uh, in terms of. Uh, uh, H to H, I'm gonna share with you, but not that CB. Uh, it's just my current team. That once I reach into the world class three, uh, whether is it much tougher? Let's take a look. I think this is the first match um, I'm entering into world class three in the H to H. I just tested out how difficult it is fighting against real opponents in the H to H itself. All right, so. Um, Let's check out the team itself. Um, this is my 424 formation uh, that gives the best outcome given the fact that we're really good uh, forwards. All right, so this is the opponents. Uh, all right, it's not too bad. I think um, quite a good a number of uh, great CBs, icon CBs that uh, this guy has. Uh, I think getting into the world class three H to H wouldn't be as easy as um, it before. Uh, it'd been another level of difficulty as expected. Uh, sometimes EA just would make it things really tough. Uh, by making so easy for the opponents in getting possessions of the ball. Uh, nonetheless, uh, referee uh, will also uh, be participating in making your life difficult as usual. Uh, always try to hide a defender inside the goal post. <laughs> so that is one way uh, you could actually try to deflect away the chance of winning by the opponent. All right, so um, always before your goal key um, brings out the ball, uh, always check where um, the opponent is running towards so that's the way whereby you can actually p get the ball past to a CB just in front of the goalkeeper at the opposite direction so right so do a lots of passing as usual all oh, right we are really really easy for us this time around seems like EA is favoring us in this match itself uh, otherwise most of the times this wouldn't happen and uh, it wouldn't be so smooth <laughs> right so uh, first goal um, it's really uh, happy with this fact that um, 18 minutes or about there, um, we managed to score first goal. Uh, good chance of winning this HOH, giving it so smooth. Um, trying to see whether uh, would it be the case. Uh, but like I said, I do expect a lot more challenging um, coming from uh, Pro 1 into a World Class 3. Oh my god, I think this is it. <laughs> right, so indeed. Um, very good cards this person has um really sad i mean if this person has real spend real money um into buying those players most likely the case um otherwise a bit tough uh, for your free to play to get that card so it's quite sad that people actually spend real money in the game um and the fact that it's just more greedy for ea to ask for a lot more uh from players all right so uh, my advice never spend a single cent in the game um even you get the best card uh, by paying real money, uh, there's a chance you lose to people like myself. Um, it's a free to play. Uh, all because EA decided that I should be winning this round. So don't uh, think that with the best card you have, um, you will basically be winning. Uh, it is just basically making you feel good uh, once you pay for real money and you get a card that you want it um, have it in your team but when it comes to real play in terms of the h2h you may not benefit because uh, ea wanted you to spend more it make you lose and eventually make you really spend more money and getting better even better cards itself so um, that's the trick that developer always use so i urge you not to do that all right so there's a danger here you can see quite obvious um if uh, ea wants this guy to win he would have scored uh, easily uh, but instead all right there's the opportunity for the person to win through the penalty but the chance is gone so it's quite obvious um, ea is favoring me this time around although i'm a free to play and this guy probably would have paid quite a fair bit in real money um to get those good cards i mean it's so obvious i mean if you look at the opportunity of scoring goal just now even in the penalty itself um the guy would have get it if ea allows it right so uh, apparently ea doesn't allows it and ea favors me um this guy even though spending probably hundreds of uh, dollars in real money may not be winning this match after all so 
I would urge you never spend real money uh, to feed the de greedy developers like EA. So do just play free to play. Um, you have your chance of winning for sure. Uh, there are definitely the opposite whereby you lose because EA determines who is the winner after all. Um, playing H2H takes a lot of patience, um, a lot of short passing required because that allows you to stay in possession and that's really important. Um, you can't be using a hero that actually pass forward all the way and then uh, trying to score in that manner. It's not going to work because uh, be it the referee or the defender is going to work against you. So a lot of shot passing is required because that's the hardest um, to gain possession from your opponent if you think about it. Alright, so there's another chance here with score and this is the winning goal, uh, which again proves my point. Um, it is so easy for me, um, this match. Uh, most of the time, I'm not that lucky, uh, but looking at this match itself is so obvious. Um, end of the day, uh, even if the opponent scores another goal, he's still losing it because it's a 3-1 already. At this late stage of the match, there's no way. You can see even the icon. <laughs> so, uh, let's see how things work out here. Um, defending uh, takes a lot of effort and practice as well. Always go for second defenders so you can push all your defenders in a way. Okay, so it seems like EA is turning the tide. Um, yes, something going to share with you. Sometimes the luck does change along the way. So in this juncture, it's obvious. It makes it so easy for the opponent as well. But I'm not going to allow it to happen. Um, if within my control, uh, that wouldn't be going to happen because it's just a 20 minutes control time. Um, had it be a longer time, definitely I think I'd be losing end if EA decides to change the tide. So given the short period of 20 minutes, I'm able to control this win this time around. Uh, because, you know, when you do short passing, uh, you're in a bit more control. And uh, there's no way the opponent can gain a so-called possession of the ball. Alright, can see obviously the goal would have been scored just now had EA allows it. But again, like I said, change of tide. Um, EA is favoring the opponent this time round. Moving forward, there's a good chance to equalizer. But like I said, it's, it's important. Lux plays a part. Um, it's not going to happen because it's just about three minutes or so. There's not going to be a chance of uh, allowing this person to score a goal. And I'm just going to control it with the second defenders in positions all right so that's about it i mean that's the end of um this match itself um i think end of the day uh more importantly uh use of second defenders and uh defend it well when lux comes even a free to play will win someone who has spent hundreds of dollars into the real money into the real game itself so i urge you again don't spend money uh you won't feel the pain and eventually just Go with the flow, do whatever is necessary, claim the free player. Whenever there are players uh, that you get, sell it in the market, get the maximum amount of cash on hand, that's more important. Thank you for watching, do like and subscribe, goodbye.